Hi and welcome to the latest in our series of Make It videos. This week we'll be making our own water cycle in a jar to show how water is constantly transported around the earth. To make your water cycle you will need an empty glass jar, some water, some blue food colouring, some ice, a small plate or saucer, and some arts and craft materials, including something to colour with, some scissors, some paper and some glue. You first need to draw your water cycle. I've drawn it in four separate parts. The first part has the sea, a beach, some mountains with rivers running down to the sea. The second part has a white cloud with an arrow pointing upwards labelled evaporation. The third part is just a single arrow. And the fourth part is a grey cloud with rain coming out labelled condensation and precipitation. Now stick your water cycle pictures onto the side of the jar. I find it easiest to stick on the land and the sea first and then arrange the other pictures around this. Then add the white cloud just above the sea. Next add the grey cloud above the mountains close to the top of the jar. Make sure you leave enough space for the arrow which you can now stick between the two clouds pointing towards the grey cloud. Now add the water to the jar so that it comes up to the top of the sea on your picture. Add some blue food colouring if you have some. This just makes the water a bit easier to see. Place a small plate or saucer on top of the jar and pop a few ice cubes onto it. Now watch what happens over the next few hours. As the water heats up, it will evaporate to the top of the jar. When it hits the cold saucer, it will turn back into liquid and fall back to the bottom. This cycle will continue, just like the real water cycle. In fact, water has been travelling around the water cycle for 4.6 billion years, since long before the dinosaurs roamed the earth. This means that the water you drink may even have passed through a dinosaur. Isn't nature amazing? Thanks for joining us for this week's Make It video. I hope you enjoyed making your water cycle. Next week we'll be making our own shopping bag out of nothing more than an old t-shirt and a pair of scissors. I look forward to seeing you then.